Hey guys, today's video is how I managed to lose um, my pregnancy weight that I have gained. <laughs> so to start with, I weighed um, 115 pounds before I got pregnant. Um, once I was pregnant, um, throughout my entire pregnancy I gained 20 pounds. So I was 135 by the end of my pregnancy. My baby weighed almost 9 pounds when he was born and he was 21 inches long. So a lot of the weight I gained was the baby. Um, but I still did gain quite a bit, and you didn't really notice it on my body, it was mostly the belly, um, but um, once I had delivered my baby, I had lost 10 pounds right there, um, just between the baby and the water and the placenta. Then later on, even that evening, I weighed myself again, I had lost another 5. So I was 135 by the end of my pregnancy. When I delivered the baby, I was down to 120 because I'd lost 15 pounds that day. Um, the last 10 pounds I lost within the next week. Um, most of it was in the beginning of the week, and the last couple pounds just shaved off near the end of the week, um, one week postpartum. So I was back down, by the one week postpartum, I weighed what I had weighed before my pregnancy, which was 115. Um, then the next week after that, so two weeks postpartum, I had lost the other five pounds. Um, so I was actually less than, I weighed less than what I originally weighed. So I was down to 110. Um, how I managed to do this was the first 15 pounds I lost, like I said, was just the baby, the water, all that stuff that you lose when you're um, delivering the baby. The next 10 pounds I had lost was, the biggest thing that helped me lose those 10 pounds was breastfeeding. That causes the uterus to contract and it also takes a lot of the fat from your body to make breast milk and therefore you're losing weight. Um, so that was a big thing. Also, I ate pretty healthy and I ate very frequently. So I was eating extra... 500 calories a day extra than what I was eating when I was pregnant, which is a lot. Um, but it wasn't like I wasn't worried about eating a lot. I was just making sure that I ate. Started with breakfast and ate about every hour and a half. Um, I ate pretty healthy. I didn't miss, you know, if I wanted a cupcake, I would eat a cupcake or an ice cream cone or some chocolates. But I didn't make that like my main meals. Um, I didn't like pig out on chips and all that. Um, so I started out, you know, like the day maybe eating some oatmeal with bananas or um, an hour after that I would have some, you know, a bowl of fruit. An hour after that I might have some hummus with pita bread. Um, maybe after that I would have a popsicle. And then after that I would have a salad um, or some crackers and cheese. You know, dinner I would have some chicken and rice. So I kind of ate like that. I would have a cupcake or a piece of cake or something for dessert every day. So I definitely didn't like starve myself. Um, or deprive myself even of sugar because I enjoy my sugar. Um, so that's kind of like how, how I ate and I did make sure I'm eating ex very frequently so first of all it's great for your breast milk to always make sure you have food near your stomach um, but also it's keeping your metabolism going throughout the day. The other thing I did besides eating healthy and frequently was a ton of water. Um, I drink a glass every time I breastfed and I breastfed about 12 times a day so that was 12 glasses of water. Um, plus the juice and other stuff that I ate and the food and the water I was getting from the fruit and all that stuff. So definitely drink a lot. Um, so the third thing, uh, well actually technically the fourth thing besides eating, drinking, and breastfeeding um, was, I know this kind of sounds dumb, but sleeping. Um, I would notice when I would go to bed at night and I would wake up in the morning, I was down like three pounds. Um, I think just because of getting rest and all that is setting your body back to how it used to be. Um, which is great. <laughs> um, and the last thing um, that really helped me, so I guess the sixth thing, was once I was fully healed, so by the second week postpartum, um, I had lost um, the extra, I was down to 110, so I had lost, I was five pounds less than when I started. But another thing that really helped me um, lose even more weight was walking. I would take my baby for a walk. Like, some, like when I started out, I could only do like 10 minutes, you know, because I was still kind of sore. Um, so I couldn't really go far or long, but I still tried to do some, like something, move a little bit, and that rather than just sitting on a bed or a couch, and that really helped me lose even more weight because um, between breastfeeding, eating right, drinking, and all that stuff, sleeping, walking now was an extra thing. So that was all helping me, and now I'm down to 110. Um, I am short though, so 110 isn't, you know, it's not crazy. Um, I'm only 5'4 or 5'3, so... Um, when you distribute 110 over, you know, my height, it's average, I guess. 
Um, if you do want to see pictures of how I look now, you can check out my blog. Um, it's msalaugh.wordpress.com. I'll put a link in the description so you can check that out if you would like. Um, I hope you found this video helpful, and I hope um, if you're trying to lose pre your pre um, oh, sorry your pregnancy weight and get back to your pre-pregnancy weight, that you try these tips. Um, they worked really well for me, and even if you're not a breastfeeding mom, even if you're feeding your baby formula, still, um, you can still get back to your pre-pregnancy weight. It might take a little bit longer, but it's definitely possible. Don't um, deprive yourself of sugar. You can definitely eat the sugar. Just eat a lot of food. Eat most of it healthy. Um, drink lots of water. Get some sleep, and try and you know get some movement. Get your heart rate going a little bit, and that'll all definitely help you. So I hope. Um, again, that this video was useful to you. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Have a good day.